Downtown Mason City is more than a few miles from the nearest long and lonesome highway, and it's not exactly east of Omaha. But downtown Mason City does have a junior hockey team that has been ready to turn the page and get off to a new start to begin 2022. North Iowa accomplished that on Saturday night, picking up a 5-3 to win over the Austin Bruins, including a torrid start with three goals in a minute 11 seconds during the first period of Saturday's game here at the Mason City Arena. Those three goals came in a burst from Carter Rappel, J. Michael Messick, and Logan Dombrowski at 7:31, 8:01, and 8:42 of the first period, giving the Bulls a three to nothing lead heading to the locker room. Anthony Mangini got one back early in the second, but Brett Morick fired one in at 7:31 of the second period, throwing one just inside the post to beat Clayton Knapp. And the Bulls had the three-goal lead again, heading to the third. The Bruins made it interesting. Carson Riddle and Walter Zacker both had goals in the opening 8-18 of the third. And the Bulls played with a one-goal lead for the majority of the final period until Simone Dottier poked one in from 60 feet plus to give North Iowa a two-goal victory and get them back in the win column for the first time since December 10th. Rapple J is a speedster. He's really fast. And LaRusso is a bit of everything, so I think... We're just gelling together really good right now. There were a few milestones worth noting in this game, including a goal in the fourth straight game from Michael Messick. He's the third North Iowa player this season to pick up a goal in four straight. Luke Baker also had his first assist in the North American Hockey League, helping out on Brett Morick's goal in the second period. The Bulls are now 15-11-1-2. They're headed back to home ice next Friday and Saturday when the Aberdeen Wings come to town. That's a 7.30 puck drop both Friday night and Saturday night right back here at the Mason City Arena. They're the last weekend home games for the Bulls in the month of January. Only one home game remains in January after that, and it's a Thursday night game late in the month against the St. Cloud Norsemen. Tickets for that game are on sale now for Friday and Saturday at NorthIowaBulls.com. North Iowa picking up the victory over the Austin Bruins on Saturday night, 5-3 to three the final score. One day, one win for the Bulls in 2022. I'm Austin Drowdy at the Mason City Arena with your post-game recap.